everyone, my name is Professor Gator and welcome back to the channel today for our Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Nuzlocke episode number 24. In the last episode, you guys, we completed the Sylph Co. and defeated Giovanni, and we also got a couple new encounters while getting our two legendary bird event encounters that are available to us at this time. We got some good encounters, we got some not great encounters, we got some great items, we got some not great items. Uh, make sure you check that episode out to see the full details of that. But we're going to go ahead and do a quick team recap here. Um, so there is a change in this that I decided between episodes that I'll go over with you guys before we go on with the episode. But first up, we've got a, uh, we've got Hypno, Kel, the, we've got Kel the Hypno, who's level 37. He's got Psychic Hypnosis, Disable, and Headbutt. Orion, the Magmar's level 37 with Fire Punch, Smoke Screen, Smog, and Sunny Day. Littlefoot, the Beginium's level 37 with Razor Leaf, Body Slam, Stockpile, and Reflect. Victor, the Far Alligator's level 37 with Surf, Body Slam, Leer, and Bite. We have Gina, the Walrein, who's level 50. She's got Hail, Rest, Snore, and Blizzard. And last but not least, we've got Nora, the Agron, with Iron Tail, Stig, Strength, and Doom Desire. She's level 35. Um, so I went ahead. I know we had Sawjaw on the team in the last episode, but I went ahead and decided Gina's actually going to be a little better for us. Number one, because Gina's got really, really good defense, and she's got decent special defense, so she's gonna help protect us. Um, plus, as well, she's level 50. <laughs> you really can't compete with that. <laughs> um, so the only thing I just need to do before we take on the gym is I just need to teach her Surf. Um, so that way she can um, pretty much decimate anyone who comes across her. Uh, so, yeah, where is... I think we're gonna get rid of Snore, because, I mean, rest is good for us, just in case we need to, like, heal up. Um, and I don't really think we can even get a Chesto Berry, unless we find one from a random item, which is possible. But, uh, yeah. So, in today's episode, we're gonna be taking on the Saffron City Gym, finally. Um, I think our Pokemon are high enough levels where I think that's possible for us now. Um, we've got Gina in case we need to rely on some of the little little higher level um but i think we are in a good position um i also want to go ahead and put orion up front because he's got the um he's got the amulet coin that we got in the last episode well to be honest we should probably have nora up front because she needs to like catch up with the rest of the team and i'm gonna go ahead and take the amulet coin from orion and i'm gonna give it to our good friend nora here where it is it's gonna be down here at the bottom because i just took it off her and there we go. And let's start our challenge of the Saffron City Gym. Let's see. Sabrina is young, but she's also our highly skilled leader. You won't reach her easily. Yeah, I kind of figured. I kind of figured. Uh, Magneton? Oh, this thing's got Magnet Pole, so it's a good thing we got Dig. Sonic Boom? It's a good thing we got a lot of HP, too. There we go. We're gonna hide in a hole. Yep. And that should... Yep. Four times super effective for a reason. Nora is a beast. She's gonna grow to level 36 off that. That's fantastic. Nose pass? No, we're staying in. We're staying in. Uh, I guess I'm gonna use Dig. I mean, it's super effective either way. Rock slide? Those pass gets rock slide. Gen 3, really? Huh! Learn something new every day. Learn something new every day, you guys. Let's use Iron Tail. And we actually hit it for once! Oh my god. That's why I taught her strength instead of takedown, man, because I can't be dealing with these low accuracy moves. Slack off? No, we're staying on. It's a good time to use strength. It's a powerful physical attack. Oh, it's got slack off. Oh, we're not. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. We're not doing this. It's a good thing it's loafing around. But, uh, yeah, so I actually... You guys are actually gonna really like this. Um, so I did some more pack openings. Um, I got... Um, there was one box of Shining Fates that was left at my local store. And... And I saw they had the, um, the Glarian Bird Trio Crown, uh, Crown Zenith 10, so I was like, I, there was one that was just looking at me, I was like, I have to pick this up, 
Um, does our unseen power scare you? Kinda, a little bit. Not gonna lie. Um, but this one was just like, I, I had a good feeling about it. And, um, all I will say is, I think, you probably won't see that opening for... Probably till at earliest next week. Um, but... It's incredible. I, I cannot stress how much you do not want to miss those shorts when they come out on Tuesdays and Thursdays. That's, that's all I'm going to say for now, but I'm going to stress it. You do not want to miss these pack openings. <laughs> I, they're, you just don't want to miss them. <laughs> that's all I'll say. Um, but I actually had, it, you'll see it in one of the, the shorts. I think it's, I think the shorts not coming out next week. I think it's coming out the probably in two weeks or three weeks, to be honest, but it's like one of the last packs we opened. It was, like, the bottom was, like, open, which I think it was just from a fact, which I, at the time, I thought, oh, are these packs tampered with, uh, but I think it was just a factory error. You'll, you'll see it in the video, and you'll understand, like, why I was, like, a little concerned about it, but, uh, I was like, I don't, like, <laughs> like, the, the bottom of the pack was just open, and I think it was just because it wasn't properly, like, sealed and cut, which, I, it, it's, it, 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 that's what it was, but in the video, I'm like, this wasn't resealed, was it? And it definitely was not resealed. Uh, you'll see what I mean in the video, but, uh, and, you, and I also have to say, you guys, like, I know I say this, like, every episode, and it kind of, like, I don't want it to sound disingenuous, but, like, you guys are just continuing to absolutely kill it, man. Like, I... We're at... At the time of recording this, I'm at 88 subscribers. That's 12 away from 100. That was my goal for, like, for, like, June. And it's gonna be April and we've hit it. Like, I, I, <laughs> You guys are awesome! And the... As of recording this, for the last five shorts that I posted, yeah, right, yeah, for the last five shorts that I posted have gotten over a thousand views on them. I, you, you can't make this up. You guys are. I, I never had this kind of viewership on my previous channel, like ever. Like, you guys are like. You guys are absolutely amazing, and I can't thank you guys enough. I really can't. We may have already hit, like, nine, like, we already may have hit 90 subscribers by the time this actually goes up, and, like, that's crazy to me, because my last channel only got, like, 126 subscribers, and it's got nowhere close to the reach that I have with this channel, um, and I love doing this, like, this is, this is not my full-time job. But this gives me something to do when I'm at home. I'm learning how to edit videos more, and it, you know, and I love doing it. And I love engaging with the community, and um, you know, it really gives me the chance to learn how to do new things by editing and um, you know, content creation and learning like like advertising, like more advertising and things like that, which, I, granted, I learned in business school, and I should have, you know, should have picked up with this, but, you know, still, <laughs> um, you know, advertising and learning what's going to draw viewers in, um, yeah, no, you guys are, you guys are incredible, I really couldn't ask for, you know, a, <laughs> you know I really couldn't ask for a better audience, and, you know, I'm going to continue to make content for the foreseeable future because I love doing it. Now, do I have to get better about recording things, like, not the night before they're supposed to go up? Absolutely. <laughs> but I, I, I think that's, it might get a little easier as the time, as time goes on. We'll, we'll have to wait and see. It depends on, um, some factors because, um, I actually got a new job. Um, it's a better position, um, it's, well, it's a higher position, so technically it's a promotion, uh, but it's just at a different, different workplace, um, so I gotta make sure that I'm both recording enough in advance, that way I have content that I can just come home and edit and then post, um, 
so I'm making sure that I do that. Uh, yeah, I don't want to learn Protect from the Aura. Swablu? Oh, we're staying at Yeah, Strength. That's easy. But yeah, thank you guys. I, I really can't thank you guys at all. Alright, and you're gonna miss your takedown. That's why I got rid of takedown on Aura. There's no accuracy. And we're gonna beat Tyron. But yeah, I'm also excited because next, what is it, Wednesday? The Wednesday after this video goes up is gonna be the, um, the Super Mario Brothers movie. And I'm, like, super excited for that. I'm gonna, like, buy, like, tickets for that Wednesday night and go see it. I think. Nah, maybe not Wednesday. Might be. It might have to be, like, Thursday, to be honest. Which, I... That's fine with me. I have a feeling it's gonna be. I have. A, I have a feeling it's gonna be really good. And I'm really excited for it. Oh, uh, why can't you like? Why can't you have um true true end? Why can't you have true end like the other the other members of your family line do? This big boss defense is pretty good actually. Slash. Nah. That did three damage. That did three damage. And down goes bigger off. Dora's been putting in the work, man. She's doing a good job. Ah. What are you, a pirate? I mean, granted, you might be. Um, and I think, is this the one that takes us to Sabrina? No, it's not. It's... This one, I think. No... Which one is it? Is it that one? Pokemon take the appearance of their trainers. Your Pokemon must be tough then. Yeah, they are. I've got a good team. I really couldn't ask for anything better. Torkoal? Um, I actually do want to switch out Nora. I'm gonna go out to Richter. Because this thing might have overheat and... Iron defense. Yeah, that's another reason I want to switch out to Richter because I can use... I can use Surf, and we're not affected by defense. See what I mean? Down goes Torkoal. Dora and Richter are gonna split that EXP. I knew it. Yep, thank you. Alligator is tough. No, that's not it. So it's not this one. Is it this back corner over here? Yep. And we are at Sabrina. Let's go ahead here and... Where are my super potions? Use those before my hyper potions. Heal up Nora. Um, let's go ahead. Let's do it. I had a vision of your arrival. I've had psychic power since I was a child. Sorry, when a spoon I carelessly tossed bent. I dislike battling, but if you wish, I will show you my powers. Okay, that's fine. That works for me. We're still gonna beat you. Venomoth? Isn't that one of the Pokemon she has normally? I think that's one of the Pokemon she just says normally. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Maybe it was Red Evolution at Venomoth? Maybe, I don't know, that's kind of... It was bound to happen at some point. It was a crit? Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, come on. You get a crit fusion? Ah. Of course we're going to hurt ourselves with fusion. Psybeam? Don't try it down. It's 17 damage. It's still a lot. It's still a lot. You're going to use Doom Desire. Oh, I should have used Iron Tail. I didn't need to use Strength. At least we'll hit it. Don't don't hurt yourself. Use your arm. Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll use Dig here. Cause I think after this is when Doom Desire hits. We're gonna snap out of Confusion, thankfully. We'll avoid an attack. We'll hit it with Dig and then Doom Desire will hit. Oh, Doom Desire's gonna hit now. That works too. 
I think this should do I think Dick will take it out. There we go! Or <laughs> I'll put it in the work. Good strategy there, Nora. Graveler? Um yeah, I wanna go out to Little Foot for this. Cause he hasn't seen too much action. I like Littlefoot. And you guys have been liking Littlefoot too, which I'm you know, I'm glad I brought him back. To be honest, he's the Johto lover in me is like, I have two Johto starters in my team, how cool is that? Hello? Um I guess we go oh, out to Richter. Cohen it's Johto Johto v Johto here. Johto v Johto. The best mm. I was gonna say best Johto legendary, but Oh, to be honest. Do I like Hello Mother Lugia? I think I kind of do, to be honest. I know everybody likes Lugia, but, like, I think I like a little better than Lugia. It might also be because I played Heart Gold, and, like, like, Ho always, like, very, like, as a kid, like, I don't know. There wasn't a whole lot of media that I saw surrounding Ho Oh. It wasn't a couple of things that I saw, but there wasn't a whole lot. It wasn't in a whole lot. Until, like, until. Hard Cold and Soul Silver came out, so. Down goes Ho Oh. Richter's gonna get some good EXP. He's gonna grow to level 38. Trying to learn Slash. No, because we have Body Slam already. I think we're good. Sunflora? Yes, we definitely do want to switch. Um. Ryan hasn't seen any action to this episode so far. Go out to him. Foe's party's no longer protected by safeguard. That's good. And we can use fire up punch. That should kill it. Oh, it doesn't kill. Pedal dance? Some floor gets pedal dance in this generation? Huh. That works too! <laughs> I guess pedal dance in these games is like a physical hitting move, but in recent games it's just been been special. Hmm. Well, you know. This loss shocks me, but a loss is a loss. I admit I didn't work hard enough to win. Your victory has earned you the March Badge. There we go. March Badge makes Pokemon up to level 70 obey you. Stronger Pokemon will become wild, ignoring orders in battle. Don't raise your Pokemon too much to avoid that problem. Wait, please take this TM with you. So that's normally Calm Bind. Um... Let's see what ETM is. Please be something good. Magnitude. I guess it's not awful. But none of the Pokemon can learn it. Besides Kel. Kel really. Kel doesn't need it. Uh, let's see. This one. No, not this one. Let's see if I remember our way out. Yep. This one should... No, it's not this one. It's the one in the other corner. That'll take us out. There we go! And with that, we have our sixth gym badge. That's awesome. Um, so we're gonna go heal up our Pokemon, and then I think we're gonna head down to Cinnabar Island, because technically we can get an encounter. I forgot about Cinnabar Mansion. Uh, which we have to do anyway to get the key for the Cinnabar GM. Um, I think that's a good thing to do in this episode. And then we can do the, um... The, uh... We'll do the Sevi Islands, kind of... That little side quest, get some more encounters there. And I think we, we can get Moltres. Well, what is supposed to be Moltres. So... Um... Alright, saw jaw time to fly to Cinnabar Island. Oh, I forgot to heal, didn't I? We'll heal when we go into Pokemon. Or Pokemon Center. Yes, we want you to heal our Pokemon. There we go. Thank you for waiting. 
and I think in between episodes, I think what I'll end up doing is I'll end up grinding, because I think Blaine's Pokemon are close to level 50, if I'm not mistaken, so I definitely want to take some time to grind, uh, because none of our Pokemon are even level 40 yet, uh, well, except for Gina, of course. So, I mean, if Blaine had his normal fire types, Gina would be great, but he doesn't, so, um, yeah. Yeah. But let's go ahead and head into the. Let's go ahead and make our way into the Cinnabar Mansion here. I'm gonna put Kel up front so he can use Hypnosis, and hopefully we can get an absolutely fantastic encounter. Can we get a Legendary, please? We haven't had a Legendary for an encounter yet. All right, our encounter for Pokemon Mansion is. Are we gonna get Redemption for the Haunter that we missed at the beginning of the run? It's a possibility. Having a ghost type on the team wouldn't be bad, I just can't evolve it. I just can't evolve it. It was a- ah, I wish it was a Gengar. I really wish it could have been a Gengar. Alright, let's- let's break through confusion and hit hypnosis. That's- Cal, that's not what I said. <laughs> oh, it's gonna use Curse. That's not good. Right, I need you to hit, I need you to get through confusion and use hypnosis. Thank you. Now we can throw a great ball at this thing and catch it. Eesh, 30 damage, or 20 damage. Let's catch this thing. One, two, three. Easy catch. Easy catch. Uh, if you get the feeling of being watched in darkness when no one was around, Haunter is there. Um, uh, what do I want to name, name her? Um, what's the name? I think this is it. Megan? Is that the name of the newest, like, horror movie character? Lumberry? Oh, that's not bad. I think it's the name of the newest horror movie thing that came out this year. I don't know. I'm not a horror guy. Killer doll or whatever. Let's use the Max Repel. Make our way through Cinnabar Mansion here. Um... Oh, we gotta open those doors. So we can get into the basement and get the key. Um, yes. We'll press the secret switch. This will open up this door here. We'll find- we'll get the revive. And then we'll head upstairs. Um... Oh, here we go. I can't get out. This old place is one big puzzle. That is, to be honest. Yeah, you're trying to get out with stealing good with stolen goods. Maybe it's a good thing you're stuck in here. Alright, Kelp. Time to teach this thief his lesson. By killing one of my one of my favorite Pokemon of all time. Everybody's got a Salmons in a background but me. That's okay. One of these days, we'll get one. I just don't know where to find one. Atkins? No, we're staying there, because we got Psychic. Intimidate's not going to do much to us, because we're a special attacker. Boom. Down goes Atkins. I think that's a Pokemon they normally have, to be honest, too. What's with all these traders having, like, Pokemon that they normally have? Oh no, my bag of loot. Yeah, you really shouldn't just, like, say that out loud. Because then we're just going to stop you. Uh, July 5th, the Guyana, South America, new Pokemon is discovered deep in the jungle. That would be Mew. Sharp Beak. Oh, that's not bad. That's not a, that's not a bad item. Gonna throw another Rapax Repel on there. And I think I need to hit... The Mewtwo switch over here. And then I think that closed that door. 
but this opens this one. So we can head up to the third floor. We're gonna open up that door. My mentor once lived here. Hoopley. Makes sense. Paris. I guess we'll use Psychic, because I don't want to be hit by effect score. I don't want to get hit with the status. Get that critical hit, too. Kyogre. It's a good thing we have Littlefoot. It is a very good thing we have Littlefoot. Actually, this thing might have Ice Beam. No, I don't think it gets into level 40, so we should. Should be fine, but we'll have to wait and see. Uh, Razor Leaf? How much is it gonna do? That did like nothing. Scary face? Okay. We just need to get a crit with Razor Leaf, and this thing's out. And this. This. This Orca is done for. Keep using a scary face, that's fine. You're not gonna kill me in one hit. I'll we'll just keep razor leaving you. Littlefoot, feel free to critical hit. You know. He's gonna withdraw. Oh, he's got a Charmeleon. Is that a crit? Oh, it's in the rain. <laughs> Ember? It's gonna do nothing, because it's in the rain. <laughs> Thanks for setting up your downfall. I mean, she could... <laughs> Littlefoot takes no prisoners, man. He doesn't. We're faster than it now because it's paralyzed. <laughs> that backfired on you. No, oh, we're gonna stay. Rain continues to fall. This thing hasn't even used an attacking move yet. Call mind? Oh, that's gonna survive it unless we. It's gonna survive this next race relief unless we crit it. Ask and you shall receive! Like I said, Littlefoot takes no prisoners, man. And he's gonna grow to level 38. There we go. Overwhelming, yeah. I guess it kind of is. Um, let me take the stairs down over here because I think we can get an item. Yep, we can get this item here. Energy root. That's not too bad. Um, and then I need to figure out which one of these is the right one to go down. I think it's the one on this here. Maybe? I think it's... Ma no, it's the other one. It's the other one I gotta go down. I gotta go down the other one. I gotta go down the other one. This one will take us all the way down. Yep. Who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here. Um, I'm coming to get the key for Blaine's gem. Cleffa? You're kidding me, right? This is what you're- This is what you're defending this old house with? Is it Cleffa? <laughs> I, I, you do you, my guy. Uh, Crawdon? Yeah, we definitely do have to switch. Um, I guess Littlefoot. Littlefoot's just gonna come out here taking more lives, man. Like I said, Littlefoot takes no prisoners. Can we crit this? Oh no, it's got shell armor, so we can crit it. We'll just kill him one hit too. That works. Ouch. I, I I I keep saying it this episode, man. Littlefoot takes no prisoners. Doesn't matter who you are. Number one, Mewtwo is far too powerful. We failed to curb its vicious, vicious tendencies. Uh oh, where am I now? Here in the basement. And you're gonna have two Pokemon. Beedrill? 
a good thing we got a psychic type on front. Right. We could just do this. And down goes the B-Drill. There we go. Down it goes. Victory Bell? Now we're staying in. Oh, I guess we could have gone out, gone out to... Probably should have gone out to uh, Orion, but... If we just psychic this thing, it be fine. Gal's almost level 40, man. He's one... One battle and one level away. Let's go ahead and hit the switch. It's a secret switch. Press it. Who wouldn't? Fair enough. Pattaya berry. We found all the berries in this place, man. All the berries are here. Um. Use another max repel. Um. Let's go up here. Grab this item. Rock Tomb is T14. I mean, I guess it's coverage, but come on, man. Really? Besides that Earthquake team we found, like, a couple episodes ago, like, there's nothing, there's nothing that's been, like, really, like, all that great. Hypnosis is TM47. Is it good? I guess depending on what Pokemon can learn it. What are we finding in here that's a higher level than us? Oh. You can normally find Grimer in here. What? Pokemon being in the places that they should be in a randomizer. That's always funny to come across. And it survived a psychic? Wow. If you're shiny, I catch you. Totally catch you. Because if you could survive a psychic like that, you've got some got to have some good special defense EVs. Uh, repel effect. Where? Off. Oh, I gotta go down there and press the button again. Or I could use dig. Oh my escape rope. I think we'll just use dig. Go out to the. I'll use an escape rope. And we're gonna exit the Cinnabar Mansion. All righty then. Let's go ahead and heal up our team. Uh, well, first let's check out our newly caught Hunter. Couldn't think of the Pokemon that we caught for a second there. <laughs> uh, she's a hasty nature with Levitate, Curse, Nightshade, Confuse Rage, Shadow Punch. Not bad. She's not bad. If only she could evolve into Gengar that make things better. Um, but yeah, I, I think that's where we're going to end off today's episode, you guys. Um, in the next episode, we'll be taking on Blaine's Gym. We might do a little grinding in between the episodes. I'll have to wait and see how I'm feeling on that. But if you guys are excited for the next episode, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button and subscribe so you don't miss that episode when it comes out on Monday. And um, be sure to keep an eye out for the shorts that are coming up this weekend, as well as throughout the next week. You're not going to want to miss them. They're absolutely amazing, and I hope you guys check this out. I hope you all have an absolute fantastic day, and I'll see you all in the next episode.